Mark Smith, the scientist who found Alzheimer's cure was assassinated by the government. In recent years, medical science has made significant strides in understanding and treating Alzheimer's disease, a debilitating condition that affects millions of people worldwide. However, a shocking and controversial claim has emerged on various online platforms. According to certain conspiracy theorists, a brilliant scientist named Mark Smith had discovered a revolutionary cure for Alzheimer's, only to meet a tragic fate at the hands of a government cover-up. In this video, we will delve into the mysterious story of Mark Smith, separating fact from fiction and examining the plausibility of such conspiracy theories. Who was Mark Smith? Mark Smith, born on August 15, 1965, in Leicester, was a pathology professor at Case Western Reserve University and the director of basic science research at the Memory and Aging Center. He was the editor-in-chief of the Journal of Alzheimer's Disease and contributed to the boards of around 200 other publications. In addition to the American Aging Association, the ES, the Royal Society of Medicine, and the Royal College of Pathologists, he was a fellow of the American Aging Association. Over the course of his career, he was honored several times for his work as a mentor to students and for his groundbreaking research. Mark Smith was a brilliant mind who was not known by many as he kept a low profile. He dedicated his whole life to finding a cure for Alzheimer's disease. Smith challenged the idea of many drug companies that Alzheimer's is caused by a protein fragment called amyloid. After the failure of Eli Lilly's Alzheimer drug, his opinion gained much support. Mark Smith's treatment was reported to entail a mix of medications and treatments that address the fundamental causes of Alzheimer's disease rather than only treating the symptoms. Smith's technique showed amazing success in animal studies, showing the potential to recover brain function in people affected by the disease. The finding discovered by Mark Smith constituted a huge danger to pharmaceutical corporations and the medical establishment, who benefited from the current therapies for Alzheimer's. According to these accusations, the government, supposedly under the sway of these strong organizations, interfered to suppress Smith's study and prevent the cure from reaching the public. Mark Smith's Tragic Accident Sadly, Mark Smith faced a tragic end. He died in an accident when he was 45. However, conspiracy theorists think that the government murdered him under the direction of strong pharmaceutical companies. As his groundbreaking finding posed a threat to their business. There are many points in his tragic accident that raise suspicion. On December 19, 2010, at around 2.10 a.m., Mark Smith was found lying covered in blood by a motorcycle cyclist between the Greenville Inn and his home in Bainbridge. Immediately he was rushed to the Solon Medical Campus, where he was declared dead by the doctors. The police investigation revealed that Mark Smith was hit by a Toyota Camry on Chagrin Road while he was walking east towards his home. The driver of the Camry was Daniel Neesham, who was 50 years old. Strangely, later that day, Daniel Neesham was also found dead at his home in Bainbridge Township. While the story of Mark Smith and his alleged Alzheimer's cure may be shrouded in mystery and controversy, it is important to remember the human aspect of this narrative. If we consider for a moment that there could be a kernel of truth to the claims surrounding his discovery and subsequent demise, it is indeed a tragic and heart-wrenching story. If Mark Smith was a real person who dedicated his life to finding a cure for Alzheimer's, his untimely death would represent a significant loss for humanity. The potential loss of a groundbreaking treatment that could have offered hope and relief to millions suffering from this devastating disease is truly disheartening. It is in moments like these that we should reflect on the fragility of life and the immense challenges faced by those on the forefront of medical research. It reminds us of the importance of supporting and recognizing the tireless efforts of scientists and innovators who work diligently to improve the lives of others. While we may never know the true extent of Mark Smith's contributions or the circumstances surrounding his alleged demise, let us remember to cherish the countless individuals who strive to make a difference in the world, often against great odds. Their dedication and passion are the driving forces behind the progress we witness in the field of medical science. In the pursuit of truth and the quest for better health care, let us honor the memory of those who have dedicated their lives to making a difference. May their legacies inspire future generations to push the boundaries of knowledge and compassion, ensuring a brighter future for all. Leave us your thoughts in the comments section.